Hello everybody, this is Ali Reza. Welcome to another tutorial of my YouTube channel, Kian.smart Home. This tutorial is about adding timer to Home Assistant and how to use it. It's obvious that sometimes to have an automation, a timer is needed. Stay tuned to add timer and use it in automations. Before going further, please click the subscribe button and motivate me to upload more videos. At the end, if you find this video informative, click the like button. Thank you. Adding timer to Home Assistant is simple and easy. In Home Assistant's sidebar, I click on Configuration, then select Helpers. Click Add Helper, select Timer. In Name section, the timer must get a name. I enter Timer. Duration is the time of timer. I enter zero. I use seconds to make the video short. 30 seconds. By clicking on create, timer is added. By going to overview, clicking three dots on the top right corner of the screen, selecting edit dashboard, add card, entity, from the drop-down list, I select Timer to add it to Dashboard. By clicking on Timer in Dashboard, a window pops up. By clicking on Start, Timer starts counting. From here, we can pause it or finish it and cancel. In Attributes, we have the duration and the finishing time. Let's elaborate how to use it with a simple example. I go to configurations, select automations, click add automation, start with an empty automation. Set a name for the automation, timer. Mode queued, triggers. In triggers section, trigger type is a state. I want to use timer as trigger. So a state is the type. Entity is timer. I select timer as entity. Four. Four is the duration of the timer. The duration we want after that automation runs. I enter 30 seconds. Actions. Device. I select one of the switches I have among four switches in Home Assistant to turn it on. By clicking on save, automation is created. I go to overview, select the timer, then Click Start. This is the switch I want to turn on. Automation didn't work. Why? This is the issue. I go to Configurations, Automations, Edit Timer. I change 30 to 29 seconds, then click save. Let's test automation again. I click on start. Now it worked. So the duration in automation mustn't be the exact number as duration of the time. By going to configuration, selecting automations, editing the timer automation, I want to use timer in actions. After timer finishes counting, in actions section, I click on add action, select car service, 
from the drop down list of service I find timer we have timer cancel finish pause reload start I select a start a start a timer I select pick entity select the timer here we can change the duration of timer it was 30 I change it to 40 then click save let's see what happens I go to overview click the timer before that let me turn off the switch timer click start the timer completed switch turned on and the duration was set to 40 timer started again I turn off the switch while timer is counting for the second time when timer finishes counting 29 seconds switch turned on and timer started counting again from 40 seconds i hope you have enjoyed this video if you have any question do not hesitate to leave comments bye bye